Hello YouTube. Just wanted to show you all how to record from the internet into machine. And one of the programs you're going to also need in order to do that is a program called Voice Meter. This particular application will allow um, you to record into machine. And you can find this program from VB Audio Software. Just download that, make sure it's installed on your computer. And then once you have that installed on your PC, and again, this is for Windows users, not Apple, okay? If you have a separate audio interface, you wanna make sure that if the drivers for that audio interface are installed, you wanna choose that driver, okay? If you do not have an audio interface connected to your computer, then you'll need to download ASIO for all, and you can look that up online. Um, there, it's a free driver, free program for Windows that's uh, used for low latency recording. Okay, so the window, the, the standard Windows drivers that come with uh, with your PC uh, don't allow for low latency recording, but ASIO for all will allow that. So if you don't have an audio, a separate audio interface then just make sure you choose this once you have it installed and you should be fine. Once that's set up, then you should be good. And what's gonna happen is once you start recording uh, audio from the internet, that channel, this channel right here is gonna pick up the, uh, the signal and then it's gonna send this, that signal into machine. So let's show you, let me show you how to set up voice meter in machine so it can start picking up your record your uh, your audio go into machine and go into preferences and let's wait for it to come up here all right and then go into audio and for driver just make sure it's set to ASIO and for device you want to choose voice meter voice meter virtual ASIO all right select that Sample rate, just leave it at 44, 100. And your input should, should show as this. Once you choose voice meter, it's gonna automatically choose your inputs and outputs automatically. So no, you don't have to worry about these. You don't have to change these, okay? And once you're set up there, you're good to go. So when you're ready to uh, start recording, choose an empty group and choose a sound in that group and then go into sample right here and you see how my, my voice is being picked up because i have my microphone showing up in this channel here all right so just consider this voice meter as a mixer okay to mix the audio all right before we start recording, we have to set up the recording. So under source, we're going to choose external stereo. Under input, we want to make sure that input one, left to right is chosen. And under recording, we want to select detect. Because when we press start, we don't want any recording. We don't want any blank or empty or silent recording from the time we press start to the time we go into the internet and press play. So we'll set up for detect. And I'm gonna leave it on 12, negative 12 dB uh, right now so that it's so that my voice is not being picked up. I don't want my voice to be picked up in this recording uh, into machine. So I'm gonna leave it, leave it at negative 12 dB. But I found a recording on the internet that we can um, record from. as our reference here. For reference purposes, we're gonna choose this, a song on the internet to record into machine. So once I press start, this is what's gonna happen. You see, it's, it's showing waiting for input. Now we press play.
used to live in so now we press stop. And your mother had to wash the dishes. And now you can see that the WAV file was created. That should, that's a clear indication that machine picked up the audio coming in from the internet through voice meter into machine. And let's see what was picked up. All right, so that worked. So now that you have it recorded, you can do whatever you want to with it now. I mean, you can start to edit. You can edit however you want. You can slice it, put it into zones, whatever it is that you want to do from here on out once you have it into machine. So I just wanted to do a quick video to show you that it is possible to record off the internet or from any audio on your computer into machine by using a program called Voice Meter. Again, this is the program. And uh, let me show you where to get it. It's from VB Audio. It's a free program. Doesn't cost you anything. And well, again, once you have it set up, and just go back through the video, uh, review the video on how to set that up, and then you'll be good to go. All right. Thanks for your time. Hope this helps. Take care.